The Rise of China's Artificial Intelligence – How China Tracks Everyone Top 6 China AI Technology A few decades ago, there was a gap between China and the United States on AI development. The United States was always on top when it came to AI and robotic technologies. But today is already a different story, because China is already the United States' strongest competitor in cutting-edge technologies, such as artificial intelligence and robotics. So, we said that in today's video to get ready to witness the rise of China's AI. Number 1. How China Tracks Everyone China is putting in place a huge surveillance system that will track each of its 1.4 billion residents, from employing facial recognition technology to identify and humiliate jaywalkers, to forcing people to download applications that can access all of their smartphone images. So as of yet, little is known about how China will monitor its inhabitants for its social credit system, but some of the country's present technology could be used in the system. In China, the IT businesses are compelled to provide data with the government when asked. Scroll down to see all of the ways China monitors its citizens already. Number 1. Using facial recognition technology, they can pick people out of massive crowds. According to Chinese official media, at least 16 cities, municipalities, and provinces have already begun to use a facial recognition system that can scan the country's 1.4 billion strong population with 99.8% accuracy. Facial recognition surveillance in China has already proven to be alarmingly effective. According to the state-run Xinhua News Agency, police in Nanchang, southern China were able to find and arrest a wanted suspect from a crowd of over 60,000 people earlier this month. Number 2. Getting Group Admins to Spy on People People in China are held criminally accountable for the content they publish in each group discussion they start on messaging apps. Even private and encrypted apps like WhatsApp are subject to the rules. Tech companies must also monitor and maintain logs of discussions for six months, as well as report any illegal conduct to police. Number 3. Forcing citizens to download apps that allow the government to monitor their cell phone photos and videos. According to the American Open Technology Fund, the government has compelled the Uyghurs, an ethnic minority in western China, to download an app that scans images, videos, audio files, ebooks, and other documents. According to the Open Technology Fund, the software called Jing Wang, in Mandarin Chinese and literally meaning cleaning the web, pulls information such as phone number and model and inspects through its data. Number 4. Watching How People Shop Online Alibaba previously stated that Zimha Sesame Credit, an optional credit system, ranked individuals based on their online behaviors. Last year, Li Yingyun, Zima's credit technology chief, told author Rachel Botsman that those who played video games for 10 hours a day were idle, whereas those who bought diapers online were more likely to have a sense of duty, as they were more likely to be parents. Chinese tech companies, including Alibaba, are required to share data with the government upon request, according to the Wall Street Journal. Number 5. Having law enforcement wear special glasses to identify people in crowded places like streets and train stations. The facial recognition glasses, which were first shown off earlier this year, are linked to a database that allows people to be matched with criminal suspects. According to the Wall Street Journal, Wu Fei, CEO of LL Vision System, which developed the glasses, his technology can recognize faces from a database of 10,000 in 0.1 seconds. According to Wu, the glasses have already assisted authorities in identifying people suspected of crimes ranging from traffic violations to crimes such as human trafficking. AI in Classrooms Artificial intelligence in the classroom has been tested in Chinese classrooms. Special headbands made by the US-based BrainCo were recently employed by Xinhua's Zhaoshan Primary School in eastern China to evaluate kids' focus levels. The headband would transmit statistics on how engaged the kids were in real time. The headbands were designed to assist teachers in quantifying student participation so that they could get better personalized instructions to meet the needs of each student. Some schools have removed the headbands from their classrooms as a result of criticism. 
Students were found to be watched by cameras in other classrooms. AI technologies can analyze student behavior using facial recognition software. Depending on the level of concentration displayed in the classroom, some programs assign a score to each student. As they continue to push the boundaries of Chinese education, the Chinese government continues to encourage the implementation of smart classrooms. Number 3. Robot Restaurant Food is cooked and served by robots at one of Country Garden's restaurants in China. Customers at a Chinese restaurant may enjoy a fully automated eating and cooking experience thanks to robots. Robotic arms prepare fast food at the Foodum Restaurant in Foshan, city in Guangdong, southern province after being taught to follow recipes for creating noodles or stir-fried dishes. When the food is ready, robot waiters and a belt conveyor system that runs through the restaurant ceiling serve it. Even in a setting where it appears that all labor can be delegated to machines, there are still some jobs that require human intervention. Even though this technology is still developing, you should be aware of how it can affect your business so you can prepare your restaurant for the future. AI Canteen Put Into Service in Shanghai's Residential Community In Shanghai's Shanging District, an artificial intelligence-powered canteen has been installed in the residential neighborhood. The canteen is outfitted with robotic arms that handle the majority of meal preparation. The price of meat dishes is 8 yuan, which is $1.25, whereas vegetable dishes are 3.5 yuan, which is 55 cents. The canteen, which is 130 square meters in size, contains over 20 seats. Bank cards, QR codes, and digital RMB are all accepted as payment methods. China's doctor shortage prompts rush for AI healthcare. Hu Zhuangguo, 64, had a futuristic medical visit in Shanghai, where he put his wrist through an automated pulse-taking machine and received the result on his mobile phone in just two minutes, all without the presence of a doctor. The little device, which has a half-open clasp, monitors the heartbeat, which is one of the technologies developed by high-tech companies to assist China in overcoming its physician shortage by combining big data with artificial intelligence. Ping and Good Doctor's machine was unveiled at the 2018 World AI Expo at Shanghai. At a time when Chinese leaders are attempting to transform the country into a worldwide tech leader, I came here to see how Chinese medicine may be practiced without the use of a doctor. That would be very convenient, Ku, a retired IT worker who was at the show, remarked. According to the National Healthcare Commission, China had less than 12 million health professionals in 2017 out of a population of about 1.4 billion. Chinese tech firm exhibits AR Autopilot Minibus at World AI Conference. When AR technology meets artificial intelligence, at an artificial intelligence conference in Shanghai, an autopilot minibus is on show, promising an immersive experience, such as presenting information in nearby shopping centers or tourist attractions. And that's it for today's video. If you have any thoughts, let us know in the comment section below. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please support us by doing